Colourful winter squash are a great addition to a holiday feast and these petite pumpkins that I found at the farmer's market are ideal because they are easy to work with and can be filled with a delicious stuffing. Best of all, they make a great presentation. This is a good recipe for entertaining, I think, because the pumpkins can be baked in, the, in advance to soften the flesh and then you fill them with the prepared stuffing and now all you have to do is reheat them for just maybe 10 or 15 minutes before serving. And you know, it's always good to have some um, substantial vegetable dishes available for those non-meat eaters at the holidays. And this dish is ideal. First of all, I had to scoop out, I had to cut the tops off the pumpkins and scoop out the flesh. I'll admit some were much easier than others, but you can see by using a grapefruit spoon and a small knife, a small uh, paring knife, I was easily able to um, get them cut and cleaned out. So once I had them cleaned, I drizzled a little oil in each pumpkin and I baked them for 35 minutes at 340 degrees in convection. Meanwhile, I prepared the stuffing, which included a wild rice blend, some sautéed onion and garlic, chopped up chestnuts, which I purchased already cooked, and dried cherries. And I just folded those in with a little bit of chopped parsley at the end of the cooking. And I did add a little bit of stock just so that the moisture doesn't dry out when we do bake it. So, one other great thing about these pumpkins is that I'm going to bake them on an oven to table baking dish. So, once they come out of the oven, they can go directly to the buffet table and, and be served on this dish. It comes with a handy trivet. I think during the holidays, when you have so much going on, you have a large cut of meat coming out of the oven, resting, being carved, you have side dishes, any way you can make it easier is better for you. Less chaos in the kitchen. So this type of dish can be prepared in advance. It's easy to reheat and bake it on a dish that goes straight to the table. So give it a try. A little bit of effort, but I think a great reward. Hi, I'm Larissa, your convection enthusiast. Convection cooking can make you a better cook. Check out my videos and I think you'll find that you'll do really, really well. And please like and subscribe.